George R. R. Martin. Um, we all know him from A Song of Fire and Ice uh, that got ported over to HBO, and that's Game of Thrones as we all know it nowadays. Um, he's teaming up with HBO to create another TV show series. Uh, this show, according to The Hollywood Reporter, Martin and HBO will be developing a TV show that takes place in 1949 and follows a young sci-fi writer who crafts stories no one else would attempt to write. So this is a very different kind of show than uh, than the Game of Thrones and the Song of Fire and Ice. It doesn't sound like it's going to be a fantasy. No. Um, it's not even uh, really going to be a sci-fi one. Yeah, you know? following a writer. Yeah, yeah, this is very <laughs> different. It sounds like so. I guess we'll yeah, but, see how how he does. And in, in I'm pretty interested to see how this goes. Now, genre. I could see them. I could see them with the way they say craft stories that no one else would attempt to write. I could see them like maybe he's got a very active imagination and he flashes to points in these stories or something like that. Maybe. He, yeah, I guess they didn't do acid in the 50s or the late 40s. Yeah, they no, yeah, not they in probably, the 40s. They had. They didn't have acid yet. They had drugs. They had various drugs. It's, well, I'm sure they did, but I would, they had I, I would imagine since centuries ago. <laughs> yeah, but that's not. It wouldn't like make you hallucinate. Like I would cocaine imagine you would have to have lots of hallucinations. Are, are you serious? Cocaine would not make you hallucinate. No, not like this. Not like acid not? would. Take enough. They're, they're two different things, man. Cocaine's <laughs> um, okay, hallucinogenic. Uh, just as much as alcohol is, I guess. <laughs> All right, All right, we're not getting into a discussion on what drugs do, okay? <laughs> we're getting into... Opium. Do you want opium? Is that what you want? Okay, there we go. Opium. Opium fits. We'll just use opium, all right? <laughs> <laughs> but it's it just... I don't know if this show is going to be, you know, like, about somebody who's trying to write a Star Wars show, or it's this guy with a bunch of ideas bouncing around his head, and he, like, flashes into them and what they would be like or how they would come out on screen. It, it's going to be pretty interesting. Now... One thing that I saw that I was really turned off by, it's going to be written by Michael Kastner. Um The only thing that I could find that I recalled that he had written was the Z Nation TV show. Well, at least the pilot's going to be written by him. I should pre uh, reference that. Um, Z Nation, which was the cheesy zombie TV show that was on Sci-Fi. And if mm. you want to know about that one, we did do a Z Nation review. Mm. I, it was not very good. <laughs> so, um, that doesn't make me think too highly of it. But I don't know how George Martin, R.R. R. Martin, I don't want to say R.R. R. every time. Why does he have two R's? Why does J.R.R. R. Tolkien have two well, R's? No, no, no. See, he has three letters and then a last name. George has George, then R.R., R., then Martin. You don't get that many. Either he's you have three letters. to J.R.R. R. Tolkien, but I don't, I don't he's think that's what not he's British. So okay, yes. well, all right. <laughs> But that's neither here nor there. But I don't know how he's going to have the time to do this, because apparently he's working really hard on the sixth book. It's not going to be out this year. Um, and he has already stepped back from writing another episode, because for the first four seasons, I believe he wrote an episode for uh, the Game of Thrones TV show, and he hasn't written one for the fifth one, and he won't write one for the sixth one, because he's working on doing his TV show. So I don't know how he's going to really have that much time to really be involved in this whole program. Uh, where where he's going to find all this stuff. So, yeah. And I really think he should just go ahead and, and, and finish his books. I think a lot of people would enjoy that. Because um, I'm not going to... more money off the TV, though. Just saying. Oh, yeah, he's making... Well, no, not now. I'm sure he gets more uh, you know royalties off of the book sales now. He can almost self-publish, I, I bet. I, all I know is depends. I'm not picking up the books until he's done with the whole series. I don't want to get up to book five and have to wait five years to f get the conclusion. So, finish them so I can read them, alright? That's what I'm saying. I want to buy it in a nice pack of seven. So, yeah. That's yeah, just how I like to buy my book. Four. That's, the, that's the fun thing about some of those series now. It's like You can buy the packs of like the first three, or all the ones written so far, but it's like, why am I getting this nice like package deal with, with a sleeve and everything? For something that's going to not be complete. Yeah, I need space for the rest of the books to go in there. It's like, it's like here's my first three. Now packs. I'm just gonna have to buy another box to put these books yeah. in to keep. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, see if they did that like an expandable box. Like, okay, here's the first three or first five for you. 
but it extends box. out <laughs> so that you can fit the other two in there. Like, okay, I know for that. Spoilers, like, because they would have to list all the, at least the names of the books. If you slide out, it's like, oh, that's what the next book is going to be. <laughs> <laughs> Don't slide out until, you know, you'll have a certain date on there. Well, he doesn't even know when he's going to finish these books, but yeah, so... But yeah, I don't know. I, whenever it says George R. R. Martin, I'm pretty sure it's going to be quality. And when you put HBO next to that as well, I'm not gonna. I don't think we'll be disappointed by whatever show comes out. Uh, I just, yeah, like I said, finish your other books. But let us know what you think. Are you excited to see him go in a different direction, or do you just want him to finish Game of Thrones? Hit us up. Let us know. Comments down below. Of course, at what's my face on Twitter, Google Plus and Facebook. Always good ways of getting a hold of us.